Let's go see what my mom is doing. Mama, you still in these guys' peaches? <laughs> what you picking his peaches for? Because they're good. You still in his peaches? They're fresh. What you up there? <laughs> you little sh you're short. You need a whole ladder. I still can't find any in my area. Oh, my God. No, she's not still in the peaches. We we pay for these. They're like $2 a bag, which is which is awesome. And the bags are actually a good size. So, yeah. Uh, some of you guys, actually, you guys don't know because I haven't told you yet. But we are basically our, our B-Club's auction. They're having a little auction today. And I placed a bid for a nuke for like $90. So, oh, well, I've changed it to 85. I don't know if you could change your bid, but I did. So I may, I may win it. I may not. I don't really need an, another nuke, but uh, I don't know. I just, I had to get something. So, anyways, yeah, he, had, this guy has a pretty nice, some pretty, pretty nice land. He has like a clubhouse, and then his house is right across from it. So, we're having a pretty nice day today. I got my beehive yesterday i'll talk to you guys about that a little more but anyways i hope you guys like this video mm, i have nothing else to say right now anyways peace out mom have fun picking what are these called again peaches, peaches. yeah oh and she's jumping for him any let me stop this clip because you're just embarrassing me at this time no, i'm just playing Gobble the bears. oh i'm glad we don't have that problem here that's so nice yeah I think it was there. I'm not sure where he had him gone there. What was your name again? Ray Show. Ray. Nice to meet you. Rick, nice to meet you. Okay, now we're, we're gonna we're gonna move easy today because. We have somebody here with bare feet. Yeah. What? We have one of us don't have her shoes on. So we're going to go easy here today. Where's it? When I smoke them, so I, I just took do it, this. Took the okay. inner cover and slapped it. That's the best one. There's no questions asked. If it calls down to the That's a swarm again. I told you. I said that. That honey is very sweet. I had to look it off my hype tool. How did you get, you get a taste? Because it goes through here, so I can just go. Okay, pay attention. It's very delicious. Okay. How's that look? It looks good. And we're not gonna... That swarm I captured. We're not gonna waste time here, because this hive is in good shape. A lot of times swarms will take off, but I... I put the bees in there and then I'll take powdered sugar. I'm not gonna powder. I don't have my powder. glasses on. <laughs> but I think if you look close here you'd see the eggs. You see eggs in there, guys? You do? There's a bee running around with pollen on her, her legs. Yeah, there's one over here. What's that yellow stuff on that bee, Ron? Goldenrod pollen. Yep, we'll close it up. Is there anything in there that looks not too good? or No. Everything looks good? Everything looks good. The only thing that doesn't look good is that it's August. Yeah. <laughs> and winter is coming. Yeah, yeah. So you're going to need more stores for the winter. Well, of course, I put the candy board on. Uh -huh. That'll help. I'll do that till after Thanksgiving. But well, I've, I've still got... Four or five supers that I so I rather than steal the honey, they just need so rather than be greedy, steal the honey off. It's like an investment. Okay, when put, you do that, put the super on here. Are you gonna do that soon? Well, I, I, I gotta call you on your phone, you gotta answer it, and I ask that question. When do I do that? Well, if you can, if you can do it soon, I'd go ahead and do it. And leave this box all the way off. I got a job. Put two on. One, two. Oh. But don't touch them with my hands. Right. 
Leave it. Leave them folded up. Get a hold there. Get a hold the whole thing. Like that? Uh huh. Yeah. Somebody equated to me. It's like. Yeah. You like that? What the? That good? That's okay. But leave it. Leave them folded up. Oh. Okay. What's that gonna do? I'll cure your mic. Oh. Okay. Well, of course, I always use the the acid stuff. You can do that too. Now, what are you going to do with that other barn? You're going to take it in the barn. Inside? Okay. With bees in it. And use it next year. Oh, okay. Because you're going to put honey on You're going to put honey right, on it. Right, yeah, I'm going to get a super good Okay, you, you don't want that empty super. Okay. Empty box in between. This one. Mom. What? I'm recording again. All right. Yeah, I'm already recording. Okay. Um, we're at a bug fest. And we're inside of like a bug cafe. Are you gonna eat any bugs? I don't know about that. I'm not sure. I haven't decided. I think I think I'm gonna try one. I don't know. If my mom tries one. I'll try one. But it's pretty cool. I'll do some more recording. Anyways, I'll see you on the next clip. So much easier. Hey. Do you guys make the honey, or how does the bees? Oh, okay. How does that work? They have a demonstration over there. Okay. They have two separate stomachs. Uh huh. Yep. And one makes honey, the other one feeds them. Does and then they vomit up the honey out of their second stomach. So honey is basically bee bark. You guys like have beehives? Or yeah. Is that what That's you have over there? Oh, really? That's cool. So if you go over there and start with your line, they'll explain it all to you. Okay, thank you. I'm acting like I don't know nothing about bees and I'm just going to ask them like the hardest question. Or not a hard question, but a nice question. Oh, that's cool. There's a queen. <laughs> How do you guys get the bees inside of the hive? Huh? How do you get the bees inside of the hive? You uh, open up the hive box. If you're getting them what they call a package, where there's got about maybe 2,000 bees, you open up the package and you just go like this and they fall right into the okay. But there's a queen, and wherever you put the queen, the bees will follow. So you put the queen, the queen comes separate, and you put the queen in there, and then you cover it up and there's an opening in the front, and they can smell that queen and they go right into the hive. Don't listen to me. I have, and I have, I have one more. Oh, really? Okay, I have one more question. I think I've met you. I have one more The uh, that's an ancient forest scorpion. It's a giant scorpion.